summer read. I hope you're gonna like it. It's kind of silly. It's called When a Dragon Moves In. You can tell something's happening at the beach. It's written by Jody Moore. I have never read a book by Jody Moore before, so I'm excited. And the pictures were done by Howard McWilliam. I gotta show you the inside cover. <gasps> oh, looks like the family is going to the beach. Oh, I see seagulls. Let's see what happens. If you build a perfect sandcastle, a dragon will move in. Do you think that's true? Hmm. He'll settle in all cozy and peep at you from inside, and you'll wonder how you ever got so lucky. With a dragon in your castle, you'll have a built-in marshmallow toaster, your own raft, and a kite that practically flies by itself. Best of all, no beach bully would dare to stomp your castle with a dragon inside. Now, of course, there are rules on the beach, so you'll have to hide the smoke from the lifeguard and erase the dragon prints from the sand. Eventually, you'll want to share the great news with your family. There's a dragon in my castle, you'll call to mom. Mm -hmm, uh, she'll answer. Listen to him roar, you'll say. I hear the roar of the ocean, she'll reply. See this feather from my dragon wing, you'll ask your dad. That's a nice seagull feather, he'll say. And you know what feathers are good for. Tickles, probably. Feel the sharp dragon teeth, you'll shout. Those are just broken shells, your big sister will say. But you and your dragon will know better. Just about then, your dragon will demand to be fed. First, he'll eat all of the peanut butter sandwiches, even the ones that were supposed to be for your sister. She's not going to be happy. Then his fiery snout will make the lemonade sizzle. Stop blowing bubbles in your drink, your mom will say. That wasn't me, you'll answer. That was the dragon. And you'll hear a hee 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 from inside the sandcastle. Finally, since dragons love dessert, He'll slink into the family cooler and nibble nom, 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 the brownies when no one is looking. Whose fingerprints are in the brownies? Your dad will ask. Not fingerprints, you'll try to explain. Dragon prints. There's no such thing as a dragon, your sister will say. And your dragon will snicker again. He, 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 he and spray sand all over her. Oh no. Young man, I don't think this is funny, your mom will say. That wasn't me, you'll answer. It was the dragon. I think we've had enough of this dragon business, your dad will say. I guess I've had enough of this dragon business too, you'll sigh. Hmm. Then you'll march over to your sandcastle and order your dragon to leave until he learns some manners. And you will vow never to build a perfect sandcastle again, at least until tomorrow. The end. I hope you enjoyed the story. I have a question before I go. Do you think there really was a dragon? I don't know. Bye, everybody.